Can you share about any regular jobs you had before you were famous? Regular jobs? Oh yeah, okay. Uh, oh my God, I had every regular job in the world. Like I, I when I was younger, especially in high school, uh, I begged to get my first job when I was like 15. And my parents were like, are you sure you want to do that? I'm like, yeah, I want to. So I would, I've been a busboy at a seafood restaurant. I was a waiter for a really long time. I worked at a video store. I worked for a small airline uh, in reservations. So I, they, I was the person that you'd have to talk to if you needed to change your reservation. So I got yelled at a lot. Although I also messed with people a lot. Uh, that was always fun because I had all the power. I could change their flight or not change their flight. So I could just chill out. Uh, God, what other jobs I have. I was a the kind of marketing director at that small airline for a while. I. I've done a billion different jobs. Like, I, I, I can't even think of them all. But I, I've tried a little of everything. I always like to try and uh, experience everything I can. At what point did you feel like you had? Like, did you start seeing a vision for yourself, like outside that space? Um, and what was that like for you? I, everyone else told me what my vision was supposed to be. Because when your your voice drops from a really high pitched, almost uh, female type voice to a very low voice overnight almost to the voice I have now, like in seventh grade, everyone tells you, you got to get into radio. But, you know, there was no internet back then. I couldn't look up, like, how to get into radio on the internet. You just sort of had to figure these things out. But, um, and I was really young, of course, so I'm still 12 and everyone's telling me I need to do stuff. So I just kind of followed whatever, I kind of followed whatever path was in front of me. Um, I knew that, I knew that I had something because every time I would go to some sort of speech or choir or drama competition, I always won. I just won. I won everything. And I hate to I hate to be that way. It's just like I worked hard. I was and I was pretty good at it. Like I was at a pretty musical ear. And uh, I went to school as an opera major actually originally because that's where I got my scholarship at University of North Texas. But then changed my degree to radio, television, film. And it was before I graduated that I was offered the job to work on uh, Dragon Ball Z. And I, they, they paid me literally nothing. I think I got paid m more as a waiter than I did when I first started working at Funimation. But um, it seemed like a fun thing to do and it seemed like a good way to use my voice. And uh, it ended up being a pretty good decision. <laughs>